So you might be having an issue on your iPhone where for some reason do not disturb mode is not working. Now this can happen for a few different reasons, but the very first thing I'd recommend doing if your do not disturb mode is not turning off, it's just always on, is for one, making sure that you have do not disturb mode disabled within the control center. So this is the easiest way to go and just double check. So if it says do not disturb mode on, just like this, go ahead and just hold down on do not disturb mode and just go ahead and tap it off. What's going to happen is do not disturb mode will then turn off completely. And once again, that is probably going to be the easiest way to fix this specific problem. Now, what you can also do is if it's still on do not disturb mode or whatever, that is usually because you're on some set schedule. And sometimes if you're driving or anything like that, it'll automatically turn on do not disturb mode in really weird scenarios. So what you're going to want to do is you want to make your way over to your iPhone settings. You then want to go ahead and basically scroll down until you see do not disturb mode. So it should be right up here or focus mode. That's our new do not disturb mode. So tap on focus mode and you'll see this thing. Now, what you're going to want to do is if you have one of these do not disturb mode options enabled. So if it's like personal or driving is one that randomly turns on and some other ones here and there, what you're going to want to do is you want to tap on it and you're going to basically want to just delete that specific focus mode. So there should be a little delete button somewhere. For example, also just find the delete button, just delete it. But the other thing you may just want to double check is with the schedules. If you have a random schedule set within your do not disturb mode, that can be another thing that kind of stands out as well. If you have, you know, for example, like a schedule set where it automatically will turn on, well, you're going to have to turn that off and you can change the schedule in this panel in order for it to actually work out completely. So that's another thing you may just want to double check. But those are pretty much the main things to go and keep in mind. And that's basically how to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.